Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in to All Things Division 3 Soccer with Simple Coach and Jackie. I am Simple Coach. And that there, chilling, is Jackie. Hey, thanks for checking out this game or games of the week, midweek edition. Um, for the 16th, October 16th through the 19th. Um, I have a bunch of games uh, that I think are interesting uh, that I'm going to just um, sort of highlight. And yeah, you make your choices as you see fit. So as usual, I start with the, with the ladies. Um, so for today, Monday, the 16th, there's two games that sort of popped up. Uh, Wisconsin River Falls at 6-4-3 and three versus a pretty – what's going on in Carleton? A pretty hot Carleton women's team at 12-1-1. One, and, one. Um, and then the other game that I'm interested in seeing is uh, uh, York, uh, which is City College of New York, I think, or one of the City Colleges. Um, at 0-7, uh, is is uh, traveling to Brooklyn College uh, at 1-8-2. So um, I actually think I might watch the, the, the Brooklyn College game of, of those. So, um, okay, so moving on to Tuesday. Tuesday, there's a number of games. Uh, Bowden at Colby looks interesting. 7-3-2 and two, Bowden um, traveling to 4-6-2 and two, Colby. Salisbury nine four and one travels to the wonderful grass field in, at McDaniel at seven two and four. This one, I mean, pay per view conference. Um, Scranton nine two and three at Drew, which is nine five and one. I wonder if I could make that. That wouldn't be a bad game to go watch. Um, and then uh, uh, Kenyon. At six two and five, travels to um, seven five and two Ohio Wesleyan. That's just a grudge match all around. So um, I think that would be um, that would be a good one. A um, couple more pay per view games that are definitely interesting. Like Coming at five three and five uh, travels to Wilkes um, at three five and five. And then uh, Catholic seven four and three travels to Goucher um, at three three and seven. So those are those are the games for Tuesday. For Wednesday, quite a few more uh, really rocking ones. Um, the ten zero and two Swarthmore travels to twelve zero and one Christopher Newport. That's a game I have circled on the calendar. Um, and another one circled on the calendar. Rowan. Um, at ten zero and two travels down to College of New Jer- travels up to College of New Jersey, stands at eleven one and one. That's just a all out brawl. And Jack, right? Um, MIT twelve one and one travels to Babson at seven five and two, and then a OAC matchup, which is really interesting. John Carroll nine one and three faces Otterbein. At nine two and two at Otterbine. So Cleveland travels to Columbus, basically. Um, out west, Whit- Whitworth five five and three is at Whitman seven four and three. Um, upstate New York Union six five and two travels to six three and three Hamilton. You have um, let's see where am I? Uh, oh. Yep, um, Suniac battle here. Uh, Brockport eleven two and three travels to Geneseo State seven two and six. Here's a good one. SUNY Oneonta at five four and three plays Plattsburgh at Plattsburgh four four and five. Um, here, here's one I'm 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 I'm, I'm interested in seeing. I, I haven't seen. St. Mary's of Minnesota at seven six and two play before, but they're traveling to McAllister at eight and six. So, might be checking that out to to see St. Mary's. 
Um, again, out west, Gustavus Adolphus at seven, six, and one travels to rival St. Olaf um, at five, four, and four. That, and then back in Jersey, you have Rutgers Camden, seven, six, and one travels to Richard Stockton um, at seven, one, and seven. Um, those are for Wednesday. And then on Thursday, only one game really popped out. 11-0-1, Mary Harden-Baylor. I mean, this is a real cracker of a game. Faces 11-0-2, Harden-Simmons at Harden-Simmons. So, um, some, some, yeah, that's going to be, that's a definite watcher on, on Thursday. So, um, a little bit light on the on the on both sides the, this week, um, but um, that was the ladies, and so I'm going to switch over. I'll go through the games that I'm really going to highlight at the end. Um, but for the men, here's one uh, to start on Monday today, the 16th. Gustavus Adolphus four three and five travels to Luther. That's six four and four. Um, also today, five seven and two Concordia travels to four eight and two Elmhurst. Um, yeah, that's that's um, I. Th- this this is probably as tight a matchup as you'll find um, on today. So um, also at four and five Lehman travels to Hunter at five five and one. Um, another interesting matchup. For Tuesday, uh, the seventeenth, I have three games that I've circled. Wisconsin Platteville ten zero and four travels to Saint Olaf at ten three and one. Um, this could really do. This could really sort of be a notch in in uh, for for the winning team here for both sides. So, um, yeah, I think Platteville would love love a victory to sort of elevate its stature um, to that of St. Olaf. So uh, also Tuesday, Bowden, 7-1 and 4 at Colby, 4-5 and 2. Trap match if I've ever seen one. Um, so um, although I do expect Bowden to do what it needs to do to to get a result. Um, yeah, here's a, here's a pay-per-view conference. Um, Eight four and two drew at Scranton seven two and four another game I'd love to be at so um, that was for Tuesday for Wednesday a handful of matches um, this is a good one eleven two and two Cortland State travels to New Paltz at eight one and four I would think New Paltz would love to make a statement here but and Cortland would just love to keep winning so uh, as they I mean they're sixth in the simple coach top 25s I'll have to check that I'll have to don't remember but um got to do that for tomorrow but um Otter OAC battle eight two and three Otterbein faces the um 11 two and one John Carroll uh, who just beat Ohio Northern I believe two one uh, eleven three and two. This is an interesting matchup. Eleven three and two. Western Connecticut, not undefeatable, but a really respectable record. Faces the six six four and two Williams Eves at Williams. So Western Connecticut, if they get a result here, yeah, you have to talk about them. Uh, out California Occidental. F- uh eight three and two faces Cal Lutheran five two and six. Um uh Suniac here, Geneseo seven five and three faces Brockport at seven two and five. Um also New York Union travels to at uh, seven five and two travels to uh St. Lawrence, who is six four and two. Not the season I think. Coach Toshak was aiming for, but um, yeah, that, that's going to be a key matchup. Another key matchup, 
Loris, what is this, the American Rivers Conference, the ARC, um, at eight three. Loris at eight three and four travels to Luther, um, at six four and four. In New Jersey, um, eight two and five. Richard Stockton faces eight four and four. Rutgers Camden in an NJAC game, so that that'll be a that that'll be a brawl. Uh, the Battle of the A's here, 7-5-1 Alvernia faces 8-3-3 three, and three, Albright. Although I do, I am putting my nickels down on Alvernia for, to take this one. Um, here's one. St. Vincent at 6-7-2 and two at, uh, travels to a Allegheny, the Gators at 4-9. Um, reason for highlighting this team is that I was just so happened to, you know, don my simple ref, um, um, superhero outfit for some games this weekend. And one of the ARs was, oh, comes up in the conversation that he's back for break and just, you know, he's happy with being an AR and whatever money he makes. And I was like, oh, where do you go to college? And he goes, oh, this small school out in Pittsburgh, um, uh, St. Vincent. And I was like, oh, my gosh, I've been there. And I, uh, you know, who would have thunk? Who would have thunk? I think he was shocked that somebody knew where St. Vincent College was. I pegged it out. I'm like, oh, the, the stadium, the field is down in the bowl and the dorms. And, yeah, he was um, – it was pretty pretty interesting conversation. He was shocked. Okay, let me return to this. Um, just got a couple more. Um, another uh, – this is one I'm like, hey, how do these teams battle – um, and and keep it going. So Teal 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 at one ten and three travels to Bethany at three eight and three. Um, I don't think they use the grass field anymore, sadly. But um, mm, yeah, I have I have uh, scars from Bethany. So and then lastly, another great matchup down in Tejas, seven three and two. Mary Hart and Baylor on Thursday travels to. Harden Simmons, who's at five, four, and four. So, um, some, some. Those are the men's matchups. So, I, it, I think on the women's side, there's some more interesting games. If it, again, if it's me, um, today, um, zero and seven York travels to one eight and two Brooklyn College. I think that's going to be a interesting battle. Um, if on Tuesday uh, for the ladies you're looking at, I would like to say Scranton at Drew. I don't can't watch that one, so I think I will default the default to Kenyon six two and five at Ohio Wesleyan at seven five and two. On Tuesday on Tuesday they're both pay per view conference uh, landmark games. Like coming at Wilkes. Five and three, line combing. Five three and five, like combing, having just tied um, Catholic um, at Wilkes is um, no. I'm sorry. Yeah, like combing at Wilkes. Five three and five. Wilkes is three five and five. Catholic seven four and three uh, travels to Goucher. Um, three three and seven. Um, that's for Tuesday. On Wednesday, there's a bunch of games to watch. Um, the three that just really pop up. 10 and 2 10 and 2 Swarthmore uh, uh, at 12 and 1 Christopher Newport 10 and 2 Rowan travels to 11 1 and 1 College of New Jersey 12 1 and 1 really rocking at those engineers MIT at um, MIT at Babson and then lastly, OEC battle, John Carroll, 9-1-3, nine, nine, faces Otterbein, 9-2-2. Um, two and two. That's on Wednesday. And then on Thursday, the only matchup that I really have is 12-0-1, Mary Harden-Baylor, um, at 11-0-2, uh, Harden-Simmons. So, um, okay. Um, and then the men. Monday today, Gustavus Adolphus four three and five is at Luther six four and four. On Tuesday, I have Wisconsin Platteville ten zero and four versus Saint Olaf at ten three and one. 
And I also have, again, pay-per-view conference, Drew at Scranton. That should be a real humdinger. 8-4-2 Drew versus 7-2-4 and four Scranton. And then um, a real interesting one, Cortland State 11-2-2 two two at SUNY New Paltz 8-1-4. That's for Wednesday. Um, and then also Wednesday, again, St. Vincent 6-7-2 and two at Allegheny at 4-9. That guy just so happens to be a football player, too. It just came to mind. Um, so so that's it. Those are my games of the week. Thank you for your time. Appreciate all the support. Um, the I have a new show with Paul Newman, hopefully coming up this week. Um, uh, um, I have... What else do I have going on to this week? I do have some Fields of Dreams coming out. do have some exciting other news, but need to keep working on that and um, making progress. But before I sort of let you all know, but um, got some things in the works as well. So, um, all right. I hope you have a great, great week. Lots of soccer, lots of fun. Uh, and we'll talk later. Bye. Boy, that was short. Okay. Have a great week.